joins us live in studio with more. Brantley, good evening. Good evening, Paige. The crash itself wasn't as severe as it sounds, but there was another tragedy that did take place. At around 5.10 to 5.15, a survival flight helicopter crashed at its landing zone on the way back from a service call. Basically went out to answer a service call of a, of a crash, I believe somewhere in Georgia, and they were canceled. And on the return flight, it was just approaching the landing uh, pad in Headland uh, when the pilot told everybody to buckle up and then Shortly thereafter, it, they said the last thing I knew, they were on the side. Survival Flight is an air ambulance company that picks up patients who can't get to the hospital fast enough. Somebody has, is critically injured uh, or is at a hospital and needs transferred and you can't get there fast enough uh, you know, in an ambulance or in a car, uh, they call Survival Flight and we send a helicopter and you know, pick up someone who is critically injured or pick up somebody from a hospital and get them where they need to go. The pilot, Doug Davis, experienced a heart attack while returning from the flight. After grounded, the two crew members aboard tended to Davis before he was transported to the hospital where he was pronounced dead, but is recognized as a hero. We have no doubt that Doug saved the lives of our two crew members and perhaps others with his final act. Uh, we've spoken with his wife and conveyed our utmost sadness and our deepest thanks. As a company, we'll help her with everything we can as she and her family deal with this unexpected tragedy. And Paige, there were no patients on board at the time of the crash, and the company says they owe a lot of gratitude to Mr. Davis's actions. All right, Brantley, thank you.